A few users were asking me how to set up another IEM send. They've got from the eight ARGs, they're running four stereo IEMs, they love running stereo, or they're running eight individual mono sends, and they want an extra stereo send running. And we thought of a way of utilizing one of the effect sends to do so via the headphone output. So a few things you've got to make sure. Go to your settings page, make sure solo, writing is set, uh, solo routing is set to headphone out, not master and headphone. And your solo level and headphone one and two levels can be adjusted here as well, as you can see. Then we'll go to our channel. Okay, so mix gain. This time on channel 10. I'm going to go to my effect send, basically. So in my effect send, I'm going to make sure that my fourth effect is on delay, for example. And my delay length, delay subdivision, and feedback amount are set to zero. That way, whatever goes through here, will be just going through. There won't be any delay added to it. The global tap, make sure that's off as well so the tap tempo doesn't affect this delay send. And then this basically fader becomes my fifth stereo send or another stereo send out the auxes, uh, out the headphone output. So if I go to my effects send for that channel, I click on effects and I hit the solo button. Now, you've got a complete mixer here that will go directly out as another send. Those of you as astute might see something else on this page that's coming soon. And then on my actual channel, the left and right, the pan, is actually affected onto that output as well because it's an actual real stereo send. Now, remember, if you're connecting those headphones to uh, another amplifier or to speakers, it's a TRS connector with left and right output unbalanced, left and right output, and make sure you adjust the level so it doesn't blow your ears or blow the speakers up. Enjoy!